D mark, D only. I want Douglas to be here. So I get five of them right here. I want John to end up back here. He's, this is Sasha's first position. He ends up this way. If she's in the direction of her head this way, or if she's in the direction of her head. You can, you can, when you pick her up, I mean, sorry. You're making the apple look so good. It was good. I was already here. Yeah. You lift her up like this, it's like, oh my god, and I do want to do a cheat, where I get you to do a little tiny bit of a movie like this. One, two, three, go! Straight down, straight over. So. Yeah. Yeah. Porter, why he would do such a thing, he replied, the bye-bye man made me do it. <laughs> it's, a, it's an article about a kid who went crazy, but it was never published. The author buried it. Well, you're definitely onto some creepy stuff, Elliot. Because I did some research of my own. And Larry Redman, the writer, he was pretty infamous locally. All right, so whatever. Movement in the but not actual movement kind of thing. One second, I have to stop. I think you're, it's like, and it was crazy. All right, let's go, stopping us. And you have it out, we'll really read it later. Grab it. And do you like coming down below eye level? Background! Hey! Hey guys! Hey, break it up! It. What are you doing? I said break it up! Now! Got you, didn't he? No one got to me. Step away. Something's happening here. Don't you see? A little it? farther, please. Admit it. That that's not what happened. I he made me lose track of time. Say it again. Heat's off. See? I gotta piss like a racehorse. And you're happy with this, Matt? And B, common mark. Good hand acting, 
I was about to get some in She's great. Just, you know, be smart. Be a student, man. It's the last time you have no responsibilities. I don't want that. I want what you have. Amazing kid. Amazing wife. Just don't rush it. That's all out there waiting for you. Believe me, what I have is great. It is. But I missed out on all this. Something happened. And then, and, then, and then there were sounds. I mean, something happened. Come on. I told you there was something happening. Now do you believe me? No way. What are you doing? Don't do that. Don't do what? Don't do that. Don't touch your... What? Don't... Elliot, come on. Don't... <laughs> you are crazy paranoid, Elliot. <laughs> Oh yes, the two, those handsome boys, are, are you with them? You have a weird house, Mr. Daisy. You know that. It is. I think it might be haunted. <coughs> I mean, truthfully, it's awful. Feel this thing is. The name. You're gonna talk to the landlord about the furniture? Yeah, and, and the house, maybe he can find somewhere else. You're feeling better, though? I guess. It's hard to be scared in the middle of the day. I'm gonna take care of you. I'm gonna figure this out, I promise. Dad, help me! You want my help? Yes. Here. Kill the ones you chose first, and then kill yourself. It's the only way. No. He wasn't a boy when he came to Larry with the hound. <laughs> what Larry told me gave me nightmares. I made him stop. Because after he killed them all, the nightmares got worse. Leave. Miss Redmond. I said leave. Are you deaf or just defective? Miss Redmond, did your husband write for the register a long time ago? You go! You, you go, please, goodbye. Don't say it! Don't think it! Don't say it. What is it? Ah! Okay. Elliot, there's nothing here. Don't say it again. Go! He said it's under the mat. It's all right, I got this, I got it. Uh, <laughs> the key's frozen to the con. Yeah, let's do. I was just. Don't say it. Don't think it. 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 Bye, bye, man. Only a 10% up of what you did. Okay. It's not a 40%. Well, that's the thing. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to be overly like. Hey, Mark. Hey, Mark. 
Hey horror fans, Valley here with some more horror for you. In the Scream series, Ghostface is voiced by Roger L. Jackson. The director, Wes Craven, intentionally hit Jackson on the set of four three original movies so that his voice will be scarier to the actors hearing it. During the scenes where the characters were being taunted on the phone, Jackson was hidden on set, actually making the calls. Also, in the original Scream, the high school janitor is named Fred and wears a red and green shirt, an allusion to Nightmare on Elm Street, also directed by Craven. The janitor is played by the director himself. So, what's your favorite horror movie? Let me know in the comments below and remember to keep it tuned to our channel for all the latest horror releases.